Hi, everyone. I was just thinking about um, New Year's. Many people talk about their New Year's resolutions and how they're going to change themselves and then the coming year. And this is all motivated by the fact that there's been a calendar change. Over the years, I've found that New Year's resolutions are a really bad plan. And the reason why is real change, when we really change as people, it's never motivated by something external. It's motivated by something internal. So what was not going right in 2022? What did you not like about your life? What did you want to change for the next year? The calendar changing will not change any of that. What will change that is you being honest with yourself and why you're avoiding the things that you want to change. Maybe the change you seek is pressure from other people. Maybe you feel like you don't fit in. Maybe you think you need to be this way or that way, and that's why you're doing the change. But changes never last when they're motivated externally. One of the things I've seen over the years with people that have had successful change in their lives, the number one thing you need for change is care. Information actually doesn't really empower change. Information may empower the idea. It may give you the information that you might need to change. But the thing that really, really motivates people is being cared for. And the crazy thing is, maybe you should start caring for yourself more significantly instead of doubting yourself, telling yourself you're not good enough, you shoulda, woulda, coulda, why not, if you were only this or only that, that whole committee thing in your head where they're always accusing you of being less than or not good enough. When you start to care for yourself, that's when real and lasting change happens. Change does not happen because you get pressurized into it. And I've seen many people change for a season because of the external pressure, but then it never lasts and they go back. And this idea of I'm going to make a resolution and I'm going to do some things differently, and then I fail at that resolution, what do you think my committee does with that failure? Now, see, look at you. You can't do it. You're never going to change. You're always going to be this way. You're, in, you're incapable. And so the failure of that ill-fated decision leads to more shame. So rather than making New Year's resolutions and saying, I'm going to change this, I'm going to change that, I'm going to go to the gym, I'm going to read books, I'm going to eat better, I'm going to whatever, there's lots of ways, I'm going to make more money, I'm going to be more successful. Um, what if our number one goal was to care for ourselves better? We were going to care for ourselves. We weren't going to be, believe the lies that we hear in our head about how we're inadequate. And we're going to look for real examples in our lives where we have been valued at a, at a level that we believe. One of the things about trying to change is doing mental gymnastics or reciting um, platitudes to yourself will not lead to change. Change is something that comes from much deeper than that. It's not coming from your mind. It's coming from your soul. And so people who have had long lasting change had an internal intrinsic motive, and then they kept with it. They didn't do it because it was external. So I would encourage you in this new year, don't muck up your internal world by pressurizing yourself about change. What I would really encourage you to do is take an honest evaluation of where you're at and then care for yourself in that way. If you see some things that need to be changed, don't shame yourself for it. Go, okay, I see that. Now I'm going to move into some things to do that differently. I'm going to do the things that I know are healthy for me, but I'm doing it because it's something that's internal to me. It's not something other people are putting on me. And the, you'll have a higher percentage of chance of success when you change based on your internal intrinsic motive rather than the external calendar year changing motive. Hope this helps. And here's to a great 2023.